New Zealand's Aaron Smith sorry for huge mistake after toilet encounter the The All Blacks scrum half, Aaron Smith, has issued a tearful apology for the airport toilet encounter that has been condemned as embarrassing by New Zealand's Prime Minister John Key. Smith, widely considered the game's best player on current form, has been suspended for one match after entering a disabled bathroom at Christchurch Airport with a woman described as a female friend. The incident took place after the footy 1-13 rugby championship victory over South Africa on the 17th of September and at the time Smith, who was a partner, was dressed in all blacks travel attire. Speaking from a hotel in Durban, where the squad is based before Saturday's game with the spring box, and emotional Smith apologized for the dress before departing back to New Zealand. I've made a huge mistake, a huge error in judgment, the Highlanders scrum half said. I'd firstly like to say a huge sorry to my partner Tegan, her family, my family. I'm also sorry to my teammates, Zru and the New Zealand fans. My behavior was unacceptable and if you could respect me and my partner in this situation. I'm just trying to get home to deal with this. Thank you. In a sign of the gravity of the latest scandal to have unfolded in New Zealand rugby, Smith's behavior was criticized by the Prime Minister at a time when the sport in his country is facing accusations of misogyny. He said. All that I would say is a general rule in defense of the All Blacks, they have been for the most part very good role models for the last 10 or 20 years, under both Richie McCaw's leadership and now more recently under Kieran Reid. They do a lot to try and prove to young New Zealanders that they're the sort of people to look up to, but that's why I think Aaron will feel pretty disappointed in himself. I think the rugby union, coming off the back of a couple of other pretty poor Puerto Rico issues in recent times, will want to make sure they send a strong message to the All Blacks that they have a high level of expectation in their behavior. And Aaron clearly didn't meet it. I suspect he'll be sitting back, reflecting on the fact he's let himself down, he's let the team down. He's an integral part of the All Blacks so he won't want to be sitting on the sidelines, and frankly, he's embarrassed himself a bit. So I'd say he'd be a pretty disappointed young man. The head coach, Steve Hansen, was made aware of the incident upon arrival in South Africa this week and that the one-match ban had been imposed by senior players because it was not of all black standard. Smith's absence is a blow for New Zealand, who are looking to equal the record, jointly held by themselves in the spring box, for the most consecutive test victories. Thanks for watching Anna's video.